Where do you go to see God? I recall a conversation I had with a young man once. As I was seeking to share my faith with him, he, he told me this. He said, if God would just show up right here in front of me, if I could just see him right here in front of me, then I would believe. Well, you understand God is not subject to our demands about how he appears to us. But there is a verse that tells us that there is one way that we, in essence, can see God and at least know that He is there. I want to take you to Psalm 75, verse 1, for just a moment. Psalm 75, verse 1. There we read these words. We give thanks to you, O God. We give thanks for your wondrous works. Declare that your name is near. Here the psalmist says, the works of God declare. They shout out that God is here. He is near. He is real. I want to call your attention to the works of God that are around you all the time. And as you think about it, all of them take us back to the reality that God is indeed real and God is indeed there. When you think about the fact that we are alive in and of itself is a work of God. The fact that we exist, the, wa- the fact that we have an environment, a world in which to live that we can thrive and that actually sustains life is an indication of the work of God. The fact that He has created beauty in this world, that there are people in this world that care for us. And now we know the world is not perfect, but if we look hard enough, we can find evidences of His work. We certainly find evidence of His work recorded in the Bible. We find out that He loved us enough to send us a Savior, that He cares for us, that He provides for us if we would follow Him. I want to encourage you today to go on a hunt, to go out seeking where you can find the works of God, and then do what the psalmist does in this psalm. He gives thanks. That phrase is repeated twice in this verse, to give thanks for His work. The more you give thanks and the more you recognize His work, the more you're going to be aware that He indeed is near and near to you. Let that thought and that practice carry you through this day and be a blessing to you. We'll talk to you again real soon.